There are 14 times in the book of Exodus between chapter 4 and, and chapter 9 where it says that Pharaoh's heart was hardened. Seven times it says God hardened Pharaoh's heart. Three times it says Pharaoh hardened his own heart. Four times it doesn't say who did it, it simply says Pharaoh's heart was hardened. But Having read those passages, I believe in each one of them, the implication is that Pharaoh's heart was hardened because of decisions he made. Romans chapter 1, and it says that mankind, for instance, it says they were not grateful. And so God gave them up. They became foolish. Professing themselves to be wise, they became fools. And then they did this, and God gave them up, and God gave them up, and God gave them up. And this applies to Christians as well as lost people. If we hear the Bible and God says, do this or do that, and we refuse, our heart will be hardened. Okay? That happens to everybody. God says, do this, and we say, nope, not going to do that your heart will be hardened. The next time God speaks to you and says, do this, it's, it's, it's like developing calluses. Okay, your heart can be tender toward God or your heart can be hard. And if God speaks and you say no, then your heart gets harder. The next time He speaks, it's a little easier to resist Him because you've gotten just a little bit of hardening and you say no again and your heart gets harder and harder and harder and harder until it becomes very difficult for you to say yes. This is not God's fault. It's our doing. Okay, it's also God's doing and He is just in doing it.